Leah Garcia, March 11, 1933 to August 15, 2023, was a Brazilian actress. She is known for her numerous television and film roles. Her breakout role was in the Oscar-winning Black Orpheus, in which she portrayed Serafina, Eurydice's cousin. Garcia died on August 15, 2023, at the age of 90. Francesco Alberoni, December 31, 1929 to August 14, 2023, was an Italian journalist and a professor of sociology. He was a board member and senior board member, chairman, of RAI, the Italian State Television Network, from 2002 to 2005. Alberoni was among the few regular front-page writers of Corriere della Sera, Italy's most popular newspaper, which published his articles from 1973 to 2011. He wrote a four-column editorial titled Public and Private, begun in 1982, for the Monday edition. He was the widower of Rosa Ginetta. Alberoni died of kidney disease in Milan on August 14, 2023, at the age of 93. Patricia Breden, February 14, 1935 to August 13, 2023, was an English actress and one-time singer, best known as the first representative of the United Kingdom in the Eurovision Song Contest. She took part in the 1957 contest in Frankfurt and finished in seventh place out of ten entries with the song All, the first ever song sung in English at Eurovision. At 152, all was for a long time the shortest performance in the history of the contest. The record was broken in 2015 when Finland's Pretty Kurik and Nimapavit performed Enamun Pita, which was only 127 long. Patricia Breton was born on February 14, 1935. In 1964, she married Welsh singer Ivor Emanuel. They had no children and divorced within two years. Britain later married Canadian businessman Charles McCulloch, but he died on their honeymoon. As Patricia Britton McCulloch, she built up a herd of cows on their estate and looked after them for nearly 10 years before financial complications brought her cattle breeding to an end. She published some reminiscences about this period of her life in My Fling on the Farm, 1989. Britton died in Nova Scotia on August 13, 2023, at the age of 88. Darren Kent was English actor, film and television director and producer. Darren Kent was born and raised in Essex with a gravelly Cockney accent. He graduated from Italia Conti in 2007. After his college studies, he went on to become a Pontins Bluecoat. He went on to film his first acting role, starring in the 20th century Fox film Mirrors. He was a keen writer, director, and producer, but is mainly known for his acting work. Darren won Best Actor Award at the Van Door Awards Ceremony back in 2012 for the character Danny in the movie Sunny Boy. Darren was renowned for his acting work and has been very fortunate to star alongside some greats in this industry. Ever since his Game of Thrones debut, his career was growing and growing. Darren was also been making his mark as a director and in 2021 the BBC asked him to direct in the series The Break. Darren was London based with a Cockney accent who loves taking himself out his comfort zone. He died on August 13, 2023 at the age of 36. Bobby Bond Robert Neil Bond, September 9, 1936 to August 14, 2023, was a Canadian professional ice hockey defenseman who played in the National Hockey League for 17 seasons from 1956 to 1973. His nickname was Boomer. On June 1, 2007, Bond was awarded an honorary doctorate of laws from the University of Ontario Institute of Technology for his work on and off the ice. He resided in Ajax, Ontario. In 2010, Bond was inducted into the Ontario Sports Hall of Fame. Bond was the grandfather of former professional hockey player Kyle Bond, who played five games in the NHL. 
Bobby Bond died on August 14, 2023, at the age of 86. No cause of death was given recently, 